Esther Anderson. Oh, you know you're a cop. Yeah, on Home and Away. Yeah, yeah, on Home and Away. But say you saw someone stealing something. Like, would you do something? What? Yeah, if it happened on the show, I would. No, no, no. In real life. No, I'm not a cop in real life. On the show. Yeah, yeah, sure, you said that. But say it was your grandma, defenceless grandma. She's walking across the road, someone pushes her. Surely you'd do something. Like, surely. Wait. Well, okay, yeah, I'd try and I help thought, out, but I I'm thought, not... I thought, thought so, Esther. That's why you're a great cop. On the show. Sure, on the show. <laughs> Jason Stevens. Happy New Year's, everybody. Yeah! Gonna be a great year, and we've got a big show ahead. Esther Anderson is in the house. Yeah! Well, welcome back to Big J's Place. Well, our next guest plays the hot cop Charlie on Home and Away. She's never been on Facebook. She loves horses. This sounds a bit like a singles ad, doesn't it? She, she doesn't need it, believe me. Please welcome Esther Jackie Anderson. Yeah! Esther, thank you so much for coming on. Oh, pleasure to be here. How do you know it's Esther Jackie? It's our research team. I don't think anyone's ever me. called me that except for my mum. <laughs> we spoke to your mum a little later. We'll talk about that. But the Facebook thing, wh why no Facebook? And who have I been talking to in the last two years who's Esther Anderson on Facebook <laughs> with your picture on it? <laughs> who is that? Sucked in. Oh, at least you didn't do the one on RSVP. Apparently I was on RSVP too and that wasn't me either. So. <laughs> with, with, your, with your picture? <laughs> yeah. No, because the funny thing was, when we met on Dancing with the Stars, you said, oh, Jace, nice to meet you. And I thought, we've been talking for the last two years. Like, what's <laughs> Just on the internet. Oh, God, I have no idea where everyone's like, you know, I don't even know the lingo. You added me as a friend or as a... All that stuff, yeah. yeah. So, you're seriously, you're not on it. And, and why not? I... So, no, I just like to go and have a coffee with my mates or, you know, catch up, go to the beach, do stuff together, not... not um... Hey, I'm going to the toilet. Yeah, hey, no, hey, no, I'm, no, I need hey, to... Hey, I'm brushing my teeth. Yeah. All that kind of stuff, yeah. Oh, I can't think of anything worse. I can't even do my emails, get back to my emails, so... So, I reckon that's the country girl on you, because you're from Geelong. Yeah. You know, relationships, over technology, because I know you're, you're very close with your family, aren't you? Because oh, I... very. Yeah. Had a little, yeah, very, I know, because I had a little chat with your mum and she said to ask you, she's a very nice lady, by the way, she invited me over to Melbourne, if I'm ever in Melbourne. <laughs> she would have. She would drop by for a cup of tea. Did she? <laughs> she did, she really did. She said, ask you about mom. the bathing incident with your family, about how you used, the ritual you used to have or something like that. Oh, no! She, she did. She told me. Because I, I think I know what you're talking about. It must be a Geelong thing, because when we were little, if I, you know... I didn't like I, I do shower, but I didn't like showers because the water would get in my eyes. So it would either be a you know bath, and a bath takes a long time to run. You know, when you're running around, you got three kids to organise. So we used to get top and tails, and a top and tail. What's a, Does anyone know what a top and tail is? Anyone know? No. What's a top and tail? Top and tail. See, I don't understand why anyone else didn't get on the bandwagon, but you've just. Mum would fill up like an ice cream container of soapy water and, you know, you do your top and your tail. <laughs> you clean your top and tail and you just dry off by the heater. But one day my dog, Ripper, had a staffy, Staffy Jibble Terrier, just come pounding in. And you're not supposed to let the dog in when we're having our top and tail and someone let him in and he just came in, jumped on me, burnt my bum on the heater. <laughs> Big time. So I, no more top and tails after that. So are you, are you just trying to save water? I've never heard of this because if you are... You... <laughs> time! Time! No, 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 you should do what I do. I just go to Cronulla Beach and get a cake of soap. <laughs> and, uh, it still counts. It still counts. All right, well, maybe I can do that now that I live close to the beach. <laughs> now, now, it's been a big year for you. Dance with the Stars, you did incredibly well, unlike some of us. So you did some all right. Of Please, I got fat it out first. You what do you mean? You did well in week 10, <laughs> but you came back week 10 and you just shone. But look, also, you got nominated for a gold Logie. How good is that? Wow. That's amazing, isn't it? Yeah. 
I was in, I went into shock for like the whole month. I think we found out a month before the actual logies, and like every time someone would ask me, so I think everyone was just as shocked as I was because they'd be like, so gold logie nomination. I'd be like, yeah, it's I know. <laughs> What the? Now, any interesting stories from the night? Because, you know, everyone builds up the night or... Oh, I... I don't know what's wrong with me, but sometimes... <laughs> I just get a bit of bad luck. Because I, I, I so wanted to, obviously, you know, being nominated, I wanted to go to extra effort just to, you know, look yeah. my very best on the night. Yeah, and... yeah. You don't have to try too hard, let's just say. Let's, let's not, doesn't she? She's, um... Yeah. Oh, yeah. thank you. <laughs> Of the crowd say that, aren't you? <laughs> no one's holding up those signs. <laughs> just for everyone at home, the no safe cheer now. Yeah, yeah. Um, the opportunity for you to return serve with TJ, you're looking good as well. Has long gone. So let's let's just move. <laughs> let's just keep moving. I would have, but I'm nervous. <laughs> um, no, so I thought, all right, I, I did the spray tan like a few days before, so it wasn't too orange. Um, and then I I got my teeth whitened. I went to the dentist and got. Um, teeth whitening solution, but you just put it on at home in, yep. it, cause I, yep. in the little tray. And I think the rules are, like, no coffee, no red wine or whatever. What do I do? I forget. And I had red wine, like, straight after I've taken, you know, the tray out that night. So I'm drinking red wine and then the next morning I wake up and so, teeth are just grey. No. Nasty grey smile for the Logies. <laughs> oh, that's, that's... <laughs> Nasty. And um, I think I was doing a radio interview at the time that morning, you know, just pre-logies, we were about to go to the um, spit roast thing and um, I, I just didn't know what to do. I was in all sorts and someone told me, just keep whitening them, just keep whitening them, like, just do it again and again. So I did it about four times that day and literally I got out of the car and there was a bit of wind and the wind hurt my teeth. They were that sensitive. I'm like... <laughs> <laughs> but they that were white. Awesome. They weren't grey, so that's the main thing. That is awesome. Well, look, before we go, because I know you're going to stick around, but there's one photo I found of you. I'd love to show it, because this is from your modelling days. Is that the <laughs> Nana jumper? What's that? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> Mind That's you, I've never mean. seen the, the Nana Jumper look so good, I've got to say. <laughs> what, what, what were you doing there? I'm <laughs> loving it. See, everyone asked me, oh, you were, it must be on, yeah, like, my Wikipedia yeah. or something. Like, you're the Peyton's girl. I'm like, yeah, but I was also Victoria's Secret, you know. That was in Korea and uh, yeah, <laughs> it yeah. wasn't the American Victoria's Secret <laughs> and I didn't get any wings, but still. The good thing about doing that campaign is that you could wear the Nana jumper, then re-gift it to your Nana for Christmas. But you, you, everybody wins. <laughs> Everyone wins. Everybody, Esther Anderson. <laughs> Stick around. There's plenty more coming up.